Okay, good morning everybody. We're out here on a lovely misty morning in Kanpike, my wonderful shooting range. Um, today I'm going to be doing a bit of a bottle cap challenge. Um, we're going to be actually using two of my rifles, which I'll show you now. Got 10 little caps up there. These ones are around 22, 23 millimeters in diameter, so just under an inch. And we've got a few slightly bigger ones there, just over an inch. And those will be for the other rifles. So let's have a look and see how we get along. I'm not a very good cameraman. I've only got one camera. I don't really do editing, so if there are a few blubs, uh, do excuse me. Let's have a look. Uh, the guns I'm going to be using today will be my PCP, which is the HW100S, which is, for me, the Rolls-Royce of air rifles. I really like it. Here, set up here. Beautiful gun. Really good setup. I'm going to be using the magazine. I normally use the, the single shot tray, but as this is a bit of a, a cap challenge, I want to see how quickly I can knock these bottle caps off. Um, the pellets I'm using are the JSP heavies, which work really well in this gun, and they are the 10.34 grains. And afterwards, um, I'm going to take down those other bottle caps using my, I would say probably the, the little brother of this gun, which is the Virock HW30S. Um, anyone who's a Viroc fan will know that these guns are absolutely gorgeous. I kind of had the intention of buying this gun for my son because it's, it's such an easy gun to cock. You know, it's only got just under 10 or 9 foot pounds, so it's really easy to cock. S smooth as silk. Um, an absolutely gorgeous gun. But anyways, let's see. I'm going to be using both. Um, I'm going to set the camera up at the back so we've got a bit of a view of the caps. And let's see how we get along. And this challenge was actually set up by another subscriber that I, I really enjoy watching his videos. His name is uh, Tyrone McLaren and he's, uh, his, his site is the um, Budget Air Gunner South Africa, something like that. I'll put the link to the description in, the, in this video. And he was actually the one that set up this idea of the challenge, which I think was a really good idea to kind of engage these wonderful air rifle enthusiasts like ourselves. So let's have a look. I'll actually go a bit back so I get all the caps on. There we go. So the first nine or so, the smaller ones, I'm going to take down with the, um, the HW100S, the, the PCP. And the other three I'm going to try and do with um, the HW30, which is obviously the, the much smaller spring-powered rifle. So enjoy, have fun. So now we're going to go on to the very smaller HW30 and let's see how we get along. Okay, so hopefully you enjoyed that. Um, I did. It was a good fun. Tyrone, thanks for setting up that challenge. Um, again, this guy Tyrone, fellow South African. Um, you must definitely check out his, his YouTube page. He does some very innovative stuff with, um, with uh, budget PCPs. I think it's really good because he helps maybe people that don't want to spend a fortune get into this, this wonderful sport. So I'll put a link to the description. But Tyrone, thanks a lot for setting up that, that challenge. Um, by the way, this... I don't think I mentioned before, but this challenge was, well, this setup was done over 30 meters, um, which I think is a fairly good distance. So 30 meters, two rifles. The last three shots were done with the, the lovely HW30, which I still think is, 
you know, any air rifle enthusiast has to have this gun in their collection because it's just a, a beautiful gun to shoot. You can shoot literally all day. No strain in the arm, um, and it's just a beautiful little rifle. Okay, and then of course you've got the, the big brother, the HW100, which is still my, my favorite auto go gun. Um, super accurate, very reliable, amazingly consistent, um, but you've probably seen that in my other video. So thanks again. Enjoy your, your wonderful Saturday. Thanks to all of you. Have a good one. Bye-bye.